a little dressy for 4 a.m., don't you think? It's a very special occasion. I'm guessing you're not referring to the protest. Let's call it a private function. You'll have to excuse me, I have work to attend to. Campus, where are you? God, it's good to hear your voice. Uh, when you hit the courtyard, look right, you'll see this fancy modern physics building with the lights on. And I'll meet you inside there. I am so looking forward to this, man. You still haven't told me what this is. I know. See you soon. Why 4 a.m.? Why not wait till morning? Paul had always been a showman. Hey, do you know where the physics building is? You mean the big-ass metallic turtle behind me? Hard to miss, man. Thanks. Babe, come, come on, Amy, home, right? call it a night. There's nobody left to convince. The protests seemed like a lost cause. Maybe sympathize with the students. If you're with that fraternity, you've done enough damage. We're being shut down. <laughs> hey, I come in peace. I'm just meeting a friend nearby. At 4 a.m.? Yeah, tell me about it. Well, we're spreading awareness about Monarch Solutions, so if you want to know how badly they're giving us the shaft, then you can just ask me. All right, what's going on here? Okay. How would you feel if you knew a corporate monopoly was taking a massive dump all over your personal history? Uh, that's quite an opener. Good. Because that beautiful library over there is over a hundred years old. It's part of the city's heritage. And Monarch Solutions plans to tear it down tomorrow. Do you want to know why? We've got a chart with all the details. Go ahead, check out the chart. Paul had always been hungry for success. Driven. He made it onto a lot of those top young professionals lists. And now he was coordinating some huge project at the university. It's a big deal for him. Hey, protest's over. At home. Now I'm here, Chief. Bolster that safety whistle. Prick. Move along. Where's your uniform? Excuse me. Come on. I've been in shit enough to smell at security. You made a long trip just to see a research project? Well, reading between the lines, Paul was under a lot of pressure. He needed a friend. I wanted to help him any way I could. Son of a bitch. Jack Joyce! In the flesh. The esteemed Mr. Paul Serene. I'm shaking money bags. Shut up and bring it in. Welcome home. Six years. Now we're starting to think you'd never come back. Yeah, me too. Come on. This way. We're going upstairs to the project lab. How was the flight? First class. Thank you for that. 
to step up from our van trip to Utah. I miss that van. I'm guessing Will's not meeting us. He doesn't know we're here. I knew Paul had asked my brother Will to consult on his project. Will was all the family I had, but he was difficult. There's more to this than you're letting on. Is it about my brother? Still worry about him, huh? If Will did something wrong, then... Jack, man. Look, I've been tight-lifted about this for a reason. This project we've been working on is going to change the entire world. Uh, why do I smell one of your long-winded presentations on the horizon? I would never. Oh, look. <laughs> A perfectly placed presentation to illustrate the project. Now, who put that there? <laughs> oh, shocking. Okay. Enough joking. The lab's this way, Jack. Come on. Come on. Let's just get to the big show. <laughs> you haven't changed at all. Impressive, but Will's the scientist. What do you need me for? There's a reason we're doing this at 4 a.m., Jack. I need someone I can trust. I need you to help me convince Will. Yeah, I had a hunch. When your brother found out the scope of what we were building here, he... <laughs> well, you know Will. Yeah. Hang on, I gotta get something from my desk. Will overreacted. Scared off the investors, ranting about miscalculations, dangers, all with no evidence. It works, but they're going to cut our funding if I don't prove it. Jack, you know asking for help is not easy for me. I am in deep trouble. You see, the tests I have to run here are not, strictly speaking, legal. You're the only one I can trust to help me with this. Whatever Will did, I want to make it right. I love my older brother, but he didn't make it easy. It's already essentially set up. Anyone can do it, but you're the one I want to do this with. Jack, thank you. I knew I could count on you. I need you to push the lever over there, labeled chronon conduit. That'll activate the core. I'm gonna run diagnostics and make sure it remains stable. <laughs> That's just the chronon conduit initiating. the effects of a rotating micro black hole so activating it can be a bit intense a black hole what exactly are we testing here you're about to find out this way we 
we've got to raise the corridor. Just like old times, eh? Slightly illegal, moderately reckless. I'd raised some hell with Paul in the past. I could tell this was different. Still, I didn't understand how massive and far-reaching the consequences for this would be. How could I? I knew Paul. He played it cool, but I could tell he was nervous. It's happening. We're really doing this, Jack. It's gonna be amazing. Here, take this. You need this key to activate the corridor. We need to turn the keys at the same time to activate. Security precautions. Ready? It's like we're launching a nuke. Wait, we're not launching a nuke, right? One way to find out. Three, two, one. God damn, Paul. What is this? Corridor. Passenger enters one end, travels around the loop, exits the other. It arrives at the predetermined time and the physical location where the machine is situated in that time. Passenger. Wait, wait, wait. This is a corridor for... You're actually going inside that thing? In the machine, from time. It's a fucking time machine. I'm going to be the first, Jack. And you're my witness. This is crazy, Paul. I mean, this can't be safe. What happens when... Our team has already proved it works in the trial phase. It is ready. We've passed every test, every inspection. We're about to make history, Jack. All you have to do is hit that switch. Two minutes to the past. Remember this moment. Paul, <laughs> what? How? <laughs> it's fine. It's okay. Stay calm, Jack. Stay calm. There's... There's two of you. You just fucking multiplied. This is exactly what was supposed to happen. That's... He's... He's me. A future version of me from two minutes in the future. <laughs> Your evil future self. We did it! Fucking incredible. I mean, just... Imagine the implications. We could warn people about disasters before they disasters happen. Before they happen. Cure, Cure diseases, diseases before, before they, they spread. spread. I just had this conversation. <laughs> Still sounds good second time. Jesus Christ. Now go into the machine. You need to complete the cycle. Yeah. Yes. Of course. Wait, Paul. What are you doing? It's all a big loop, Jack. I need to enter the machine and travel back to the moment I exited the machine in order to, well, be here. And what if you don't? There is no what if. I'm here. It's already happened. You saw it, Jack. We did it. Oh, that's impossible. That's, that's literally impossible. I mean, I can't even... There's no time to stop now. We need to test the other direction. Set the machine to five minutes to the future. What are you doing? Oh, no. Jack. Will? You have to help me with this. We have to shut this thing down now. No, 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 no. Stop it. Shut up. Yeah, hold, hold on. The core. Hold on. We can't shut it down. Paul's still in there. Will. Shut up. Look shut at me. up. Look at me. Put the gun down and we can talk, okay? No, there's no time. You're not thinking straight. Put the gun down. Jesus Christ, Will. Time is going to end. Jack, you have to trust me. For what?
okay? I think so. I'll find a way out. Make sure Will's okay. Yeah. Okay. I could hear Will's words in my head. Time is going to end. It should have worked, Jack. It should have worked. Is this really happening? What the hell? This is crazy. Well... first time my power started to manifest. An out-of-control burst of energy that saved Will. Jack, your proximity to the pulse, it, it must have altered your relation to the crew, Will. What I just did back there. What the hell is happening? That's what I'm telling you. Not in the right language. An explosion make time go bad. If time is an egg, then that egg is fucking broken. A time egg is fucked. What? Why is there an egg in this? There's a fracture in time. It's breaking down, leading to the end of time, and door. Uh, what? Locked. They cut my security clearance. <laughs> that didn't help. Stand back. I'll get it open. HQ, securing the well, server room. Over. More of them. Hide. Coming in here. I warned Paul about this. About the calculation. 
auditions. I tried to make you listen to me. By shoving a gun in my face? Yes, a gun. The universal symbol for shut the fuck up and listen to me. Sound logic is all of this. Shh, you... Here on this side. We sure he didn't head back up to the lab? He could have gone back and tried to take the service this elevator. Doesn't make any sense. Five's on his way there. How? Why Orders are you even here? Is your biggest block. concern right now? Backup's on route to flush him out. Paul brought me here to clean up your mess. My mess? Do you even. Here, a lot happens in six years. It's bigger than us. Can't make it personal. They're trying to kill us, Will. It's pretty goddamn personal. Listen, getting you involved is the last thing I wanted. I, I'm sorry. Right. is only going to get worse. We have to stop this before it's too late. How? First, we have to get to my car. You're better at the door thing. Will, get out! Oh God, it's armed! Opening fire! We're pinned down! Yeah, I know that. Are you okay? I think so. But Jack, that was... I know. This is way out of hand. I'd used a gun before. I've been in a couple tough spots. Never had an army of pro gunmen chase me. Not good. This is not good. There's the elf. It's coming down. Hide! Not again. Watch out! One off! One off! One off! Firing at us! You tell me! Tons acting up again. No surprise. We have to go. Raider team, have Jack and William Joyce been detained? Did you hear that? They know our names. They knew we'd be here. They must be after the machine. The elevator. It's the only way out. 